Get him. Boom! In the air! Sniped! Sniped with Arbalist. Triple kill! We just killed that hawk in two shots. Do you guys remember the Arbalist sniper weapons? These were released years ago and they never really caught on. But we have Mark III. I upgraded these things actually. Reload time, 6 seconds, 1100 meter range. And to get the most damage possible, we have pilot skills loaded up, double nuke amps, and even a thermonuclear reactor. Our power man skill is going to give us a faster reload. And then we have increased damage. And then our paunchy pilot kind of gives us the built-in anti-control when we're using our ability. So let's try these things out. Let's do it. I have no idea how this is going to work. Beacon Rush, Arbalist, let's go. Okay, we're here in Springfield and we're going to drop this thing right away. Also, we have our Octanian Damage Drone. The Octanian Drone is kind of like a damage boosting drone. So when we hit our healing, we deal 70% more damage for about 7 seconds. Okay, so these are just bare bones. It looks 6 second reload time. Man, the weapons actually look pretty cool. They're glowing, and my main goal is, to be honest, I don't expect these weapons to do a whole lot of damage at base level Mark III. I think our only chance to see some actual damage is to get our nuke amp loaded up, so that's exactly what we're going to do, and we will do it. I'm determined. I am determined to get our nuke amp to 95. Okay, teammate, teammate, I'm boosting up my teammate. I'm going to try to help you out, bro, but I can't do a whole lot here. Like, ah, oh, I, like, it's kind of pointless shooting at that Skyros while he's in the ball. But our Octanian drone will give us, like I said, another 70% damage boost. It's a bit of damage. Bit of damage. Okay, come on, load up, load up. Oh, we just switched. He just switched. And remember, also shooting at Aegis Shields actually does count towards your nuke amp building. Oh, that was weird. That guy just lagged out and ate the damage. It was like, delayed. So we captured... Good job, teammate. My teammate capped center beacon. My other teammate's got a Fabnir with Pulsar and Wasp. That is a weird build. All right. We capped center beacon. They still have the damn beacon, though, in their home. Whoa, that was good damage. That was solid. Let's see if we can get him. We can get him. We can get him. Boom! In the air! Sniped. Sniped with Arbalist. Okay, let's move up. Let's try to get a better vantage point. That guy lagged out too. But the damage hit. Oh, I should have shot there. Ow! That's a Hades. He put his shield up. New camp is up to 40. We're building. We're growing. We're growing stronger. <laughs> I don't know what accent that is. We're growing. That's my Arnold Schwarzenegger impression. He goes, we're, we're growing. We're growing stronger. We're going with the... We're growing. We're growing stronger. Probably terrible. Okay, we're gonna back up. We're losing health. We're losing health. Oh, we almost got him. Somebody else kill him. Okay, somebody else killed him. We almost got that kill. Nuke amp up to 58. It's actually building here. What's that guy? What's one two one two 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 one? Yeah. Yeah. Jeez, they actually capped our home beacon. Okay, so this is a camping build, but we're kind of camping right now, even though we're moving all over the map. But, oh, that was actually good damage. If our team gets in trouble, then I am willing to ditch this thing. Oh, that guy's healing faster than we can deal damage. Our nuke amp is fully loading up, though. It's building, and we're dealing more damage per shot. We want that 76% damage boost. Uh... On. I forget what the actual full damage amount. If you start from zero and want to build your nuke amp up to the full stack at 95, I think it's something like maybe 1.7 million damage you need to deal. That was pretty good. We're getting stronger. Oh, the guy's covering up. I'd love to shoot a Titan a little bit. I'd love to shoot like an Ao Ming or something from across the map because we have an 1100 meter range. That is probably further than any other weapon that someone's running right now in this game. Oh, Falcon, you want some? You want some cheddar cheese, bro? You cheese nugget? That Falcon, I know he's got the fangs out. There we go. That was good damage. 
Okay, I think our weapons are now actually dealing good damage. They're dealing decent damage. Boom! Killed! There we go. Uh oh, back up. Miramitz is shooting at me with his Dazzler Lantern build. Oh, let's shoot that guy. That's an Ao Ming. Boom! There we go. A little bit of an 1100 meter range snipe. I think that was a thousand meters there. Alright. Okay. That Kepri's pushing towards us. It's funny that their team is not pushing towards this side at all. I mean, they do have our home beacon, but they need three beacons. They're gonna lose the game. Boom! Double kill! See you later, bro! Pack it up! Pa pack! Pack! It up! Is it a stroke damage? That was good damage. Oh, we didn't get that kill quite. That is an Ao Ming. I want to shoot that guy. Murderous R. Let's see what this... Man, that's not bad. He's healing now, but that was not bad. For how old these weapons are, I think these weapons were actually buffed, like... How long ago were these buffed? I think they were buffed on the last big rebalance. They got a 15... Oh, we didn't get that kill, though. They were buffed by, like, 15% damage on the last rebalance update. Whoa! That was a lot of damage. That was decent. Triple kill! We just killed that hawk in two shots. That was the Juan guy. We smoked him. We smoked him. If, the, if this guy gets close, we're going to drop in the luchador. And we're going to kill him. Not my luchador, my uh, Heimdall. Okay, it looks like we're going down. Oh, we actually don't have time to. We won it. We stayed in that build the whole game. And once we got the nuke amp going, the damage was good. Before that, the damage was pretty crap salad. It was a turd burrito before that. 2.1 million is not bad, actually. Man, it's, it's like the upper hand of the scoreboard, too. Damage not too shabby. Let's go game two. Let's see if we can do better than that. Here we go. Okay, Canyon map, the other big map. I think it would be an absolute disaster if we dropped... If we tried to use this build on a smaller map. It's just not going to work. But these bigger maps give us a chance. Springfield, geographically, I think... There's some damage. Is the biggest map in the game right now? I guess. Because, man, one side to the other of Springfield is pretty big. Canyon, I don't think is actually that big. I think it's more just really... Actually, I take that back. It's probably pretty big, but it's more just really open. So it seems bigger. That's him. Um, that's some damage. That's some damage. That's some damage. Come on. Someone show yourself. That Erebus back there. We gotta get through his Aegis shield. And it's gonna take forever. Granted, it's gonna still boost up our nuke amp. Man, that is... Those duo Kepri's just took our beacon. I'm gonna go with my teammate here. Alright, what's he got? Typhon, Stellar, Wasp? I'm gonna go with you, teammate. I'm going with you, team. Teammate. I'm going with you. Yeah. That Skyros is capturing our home, but we do have three beacons still. Man, I want to snipe. I want to snipe, man. That's all I want. I just want sweet one-hit kills. Not sure if we're going to get one hit. The last game, we did get a two-hit, but one hit is kind of a different uh, scenario. Man, why do these weapons have to... Like, the glowing on the weapons looks awesome. It looks like some weird weapon that's in, like, an Avatar movie. Speaking of Avatar, the new Avatar movie trailer was released. It's coming out this December. Uh, we're gonna have to back up. We're gonna have to back up. I'm gonna try to take down this guy, but... That's good damage, but he's healing now. Man, couldn't these weapons deal, like, gray damage at least or something? They're just so old! Okay, okay, alright, alright. Ooh, that Erebus just took some heavy damage. Action Jackson. Ah! I missed a shot! Come on, man. We all know you eat soybeans for breakfast. Soybeans. Can somebody help me out here? My nuke amped up to 48, and I can't really kill this guy these dumb weapons. Oh, oh, come on. We didn't get the kill. 
We're getting four capped though. We are getting four capped right now. So we're gonna need this beacon. Oh, my teammate. Okay, never mind. My teammate's gonna grab the beacon, I think. Thank you, teammate. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it, man. This guy. This guy. Oh, we couldn't even get that kill. Could we get one kill this game? And now he's going up. Fantastic. Fantastic. Okay, we're gonna... We might have to ditch this thing pretty soon. We're down on the beacon bar. We still have lots of time, but... This is not working very well this, this time around. Okay, boost you up, teammate. Teammate. Man, that was with our Octanian drone boost, too. The 70%. <clears throat> Man, I think it's an understatement to say these weapons need a huge buff. I think there's almost too many sniper weapons in the game, to be honest. I think... Pixonic just released so many sniper weapons that they kind of I don't know it feels like they made a sniper weapon and then they forgot that they made Like the same sniper weapon a year or two before Like the prisma It's like the flux is like the same. Oh, we're gonna die here. We're gonna die. We're gonna die The flux is like the same weapon as the prisma the prisma are just better And Pixonic really forgot about the flux and we're like we're gonna release a heavy laser weapon And everyone's like bro. We, you already did that you already did that. Come on, we can kill this guy. Man, this guy is still not dead. I saw him earlier. Oh, we got him, we got him. Okay, he's dead. Let's push forward a little bit here. No more sitting back. No more camping around, bro. Okay, let's keep moving. Yeah, as you can see, we have our Razda Typhon. I'm curious as to how this build will work. Whoa, that damage is good. That was some pretty serious damage. That Erebus is still sitting back there and camping, so let's see what we can do here. There we go, shredding him up. Shredding him up. I feel like I would almost like these curving bullet weapons if, pick, if you could only, like, equip them on, you know, not meta robots or not top five robots in the game. That way they would actually be... A little bit more balance. There we go. Kill. But I don't think Big Sonic would ever do that. Okay, we're losing. Are we losing Beacon A? Shredding, shredding, shredding. Boom! Titan, Titan Flare. Oh, this was the guy that was in the Erebus. He now dropped in a Behemoth. An Incinerator Behemoth. Oh, we almost got him. We're out of ammo. We're out of ammo. We gotta retreat, retreat, retreat. I always liked the Typhon. I always thought it was a pretty fun robot. Okay, there we go. We hit him with the blackout. Shredding him up like iceberg lettuce. Triple kill. We're on a kill streak here. We are on a kill streak. Whoa. Hit him, hit him. Okay, we got him. We hit him with the blackout. Or did we just. Yeah, I think so. We're going down. We're going down. Our health is going down. Hang in there. Hang in there, Typhon. Oh, we didn't get him. Nuggets. There we go. We hit that guy. Can we get this kill? Ah! This is actually a close game. We're down on the beacon bar still. We're down 3-2. to two, And they actually have the... Not th we're up 3-2, to two, but we're down on the beacon bar itself. Okay. Oh, man. This is risky. This is risky because this is our home beacon, or one of our home beacons, but it's going to be tough to grab it because they got a lot of players here. We're going to drop down. We have to drop down. He's shredding me up. This is not looking good. This is not good. This is bad. We're going to lose. Are we really going to lose this Heimdall? Oh, this thing sucks. This thing sucks, this Heimdall. Oh my god, screw the Heimdall. That sucked. Our Typhon performed better than the Heimdall. The Heimdall is not meta. I'm sorry to say, even if you run the best weapons, I know we didn't play it the best there, but it's still not meta. It gets obliterated. Like, I, I'm pretty sure, I'm like 99% sure an Arthur would win in a 1v1 against a Heimdall. If you had, like, you know, similar builds going 1v1 against each other. Yeah, get my, my revenge. Yeah, not so tough are you now, Mender? You fat blob. There we go. There's another mender. I keep seeing this action Jackson guy. 
Yeah, you guys aren't so tough now when you don't have three players to help you out. Okay, he's gonna heal. It looks like we actually have a five cap. We may... Whoa, my... Where did my... Oh, he dropped in. I was gonna be like, where did my teammate just come from? But he just dropped in on the beacon. Boom, double kill. Easy. Easy work. Here we go. We got the five cap. Almost have the five cap. And we're cooking. There we go. Man, the Arbalist, definitely, they would need a huge buff, like a 30% buff, to be even viable in Champion League. But I would not recommend them. But that's how they perform years later. 5.3 million damage, not too bad. The first game was a lot better. Arbalist, rip, rest in peace. Smoky chicken steak sandwich.